today is November 4th, okay? And I haven't filmed anything because I had to go take care of some business, y'all. So y'all know, um, about, a, about what, maybe about two weeks ago now, we was in a car accident. And I've been waiting on the insurance company to get the car, um, you know, the person that hit us or whatnot, get their um, car insurance and stuff like that, and then take it. So, um, I had to drop off my car today, and because the car is, you know, in my name and everything, I had to be there to drop it off, to sign the paperwork, and to get the rental, okay? So, I'm just coming back from getting the rental or whatnot. And they did me good. They did me good. Put me in a little small SUV, little 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 Nissan Rogue or whatnot, and I like it. Even though I said though I I still want to get me a van because that's what I want. I like it, but um, you know, I got it, picked it up or whatnot, and you know, drove it back. It drives so smooth, y'all. Um, so I'm probably gonna miss what I gotta give it back. But either way it go, I'm gonna work hard to get um me something because I hadn't been really I hadn't been driving. I hadn't been driving since we started sharing my car. I just been just like every time we go somewhere, I'll give a run of the keys and just, you know, you drive or whatnot. So literally I haven't been driving. I like to to have my own vehicle because I care for it in a way that I like to care for it. And so I just, if I got to share it, I just won't even <laughs> drive. I know. But that's just the way I am. And some of y'all probably feel the same way or whatnot. So I haven't been driving. Just um, whenever we go somewhere, I just have him to drive or whatnot. Um, in case I have to, have to, have to or whatnot. So I hadn't, like, I feel like I hadn't drove in forever. <laughs> ever ever <laughs> or whatnot so yeah that's what i just got through doing um coming back from dropping it off they said probably about two to three weeks um they said probably about two to three weeks probably gonna be sooner than that but they're estimating two to three weeks for them to get the um the car fixed or whatnot so i'll probably be on a rental for that long is what the estimation is but i think it's probably gonna be a week i think my car will be ready in a week okay but i'm not sure because they said they got to send it to take pictures they got to break it down take pictures of the damage send it and then order parts and all that type of stuff so with everything going on it could take longer than that depending on the parts or whatnot so yeah, so now back home and need to see what else got to be done. So yeah, I'll give y'all a little look at this Nissan Rogue. Look at this. So it's one that um I already put my sanitizer and stuff in here. It one's that it's one that when you stop it shut off and then come back on. I will get out and show y'all I like it. Y'all, but I still want I still want a van, but oh my goodness, for me not have been driving for a minute, I would still do something like this. So they did me good. They did your girl good by putting me in something bigger because, uh, you know, like I say, my car is a car. It ain't a little SUV, but this just makes me want to work even harder to get, you know, a uh, male vehicle that I want, you know, so, um... And then Rundae can just <laughs> just have that car to himself, you know. Um, so I need to get me another vehicle and get what I want, you know what I'm saying. I was thankful of having the car, but, you know, because I was a first-time buyer. So, being a first-time buyer, I had to get a car and not an SUV. So, yeah, just having this as a rental motivates me even more. Motivates me even more to, you know... Um, get what i want and it's more spacious and stuff for the kids or whatnot so i'm gonna definitely enjoy it for the time that i have but just keep in mind that you know what my goal is um and it's good because i'm 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 a type i've always been type to have to, to like big body cars okay i, I don't I, I have to have something bigger you know <laughs> bigger because i for, for some reason i control them in the road better than i do a small car so yeah this is motivation it's motivation maybe it was meant for them to put me in something like this instead of a, a car for me to just get that motivation of you know what <laughs> you get what i'm saying so yeah y'all so let me go and get in this house though and get to doing some more stuff now that i got this out the way 
All right, y'all. So it's the next day, November 5th. Okay, and it's election day on this day. So um, I had to go to the grocery store and get a couple things. I didn't film much yesterday after getting the car. I just, no, I didn't feel, film much um, yesterday um, or whatnot. So, because after dealing with that process of going there and all that type of stuff or whatnot. So um, November 5th is, so it's the next day. And look, y'all. Vanilla spice egg. Now, I know I don't need it. I don't need it. But wanted to try. It's that time of season. But I'm experimenting with some things that I'm trying to make it easier on me. So, when I don't cook meat and stuff like that. Because it's five people, y'all. And the prices of food, like the roasts and stuff that I've been doing for the past month or two. The pork shoulders and all that. It's still with five people. We eat that. It's hard to even freeze it and have enough, you know. So, um, for the days that I'm very, very busy and don't get to do that to freeze food and stuff, I'm trying to experiment with this. Like, getting this, because you can take, I know it's processed, but you can get one chicken patty and put a lot of vegetables and rice with it and you got a meal. You know what I'm saying? I love to do sides. I don't care about cooking meat that much. But we need me, unless it's crock pot. Now, I throw it in the crock pot. So, I just went to the store and got some reduced um, fat milk. Some tomatoes for some sandwiches and salad mix or whatnot um, because my salad is coming up. But I'm dropping so much more because it takes a lot of salad for five people no matter how much you grow in the garden. Um, got some cheese. some um, And I need to eat more. I need to eat more but the right food, okay? Got some bacon because I got some cabbages that I need to cut up and cook some cabbage so I'm putting some bacon in it. Um, got some of these beef patties. These are easy. Um, but instead of um, paying $6 for the beef patty cocoa bread, I just went and got the beef patties with cheese. They got the mild one and they got the spicy one. But I got And they got the one with cheese. So I got a couple boxes of those and I just picked up some hamburger helper because I got some ground beef that's um, out and that is what... We're going to have for dinner, okay, with some vegetables. The key thing is to add a lot of vegetables, y'all, because it just be like this sometimes. I done tried different ways and, and trying to make stuff, doing stuff from scratch. It's too much time. And you still, you still ain't hauling no better shape doing it from scratch because you still got to buy the ingredients and get the flour and all that stuff from the stove. So either way it goes, you're still getting preservatives and all that type and I had to sit down and, and rethink some things okay I'm working harder not smarter so um but I know I need to eat more food too um we done already supplemented for today with our iron and I just need to I haven't ate nothing but some applesauce to do that myself so I need to go ahead and get something quick in me so I can have the energy to deal with the other stuff so I open this pack right here and I wanted to count and see how many was in there. It's nine. And normally, if I go to the store and buy a, a pack of chicken, it's about nine, ten dollars now. Okay? And we get about two pieces of chicken out of it. I'm looking at time and still trying to keep it easy. Now, those of you that want to say, oh, it's processed and stuff, you ain't buying everything and cooking every single thing from scratch. And if you are, it may be just you. And your significant other in the house, you can do that. I got three children in the house, and my daughter is 18, but I, I'm country. I'm where I'm from. We all that's gonna forever be my child. I'm not downplaying her by her being 18, and I'm saying, but uh, she's still my child, so that'll forever be. So, those of you that don't like that, you can exit off, go ahead, exit off. I, I go by the way I was brought up in my, my roots and how I, how I do things being a Mississippi girl, okay? If you from another place and y'all don't say that, just, just hey, you do not have to be in the comments and talk about you talking about she's a child. She's forever be my child. So, I have three children in this house. Now, I don't treat her like she like no little they or nothing like that. But still, my the way I talk is the way I talk, okay? Um, here's what it is. But, I have three children in the house, and it's two adults. Look. <laughs> uh-uh. And I have so much to do. So, this is what I mean right here, okay? Um, it was nine in here. So, one more would give us two patties each. 
You know, and you can have one patty with your lunch and one patty with your dinner. Now, I'll make all the sides because the sides is very easy. Vegetables and stuff is very easy. They are marked down six, uh, five ninety nine, And I'm definitely going to have to go back for that sale is up. And stock my freezer because if you take this and you have this and you eat a lot of vegetables and eat healthy, I don't care what nobody say. It kind of cancel that out, you know, but you're still getting the meat, the protein and all that type of stuff from this. OK, and especially if you have other stuff. Now, I'm not saying this is a daily thing to do, but this is a couple times a week, especially if you cooking roast and stuff like that. You have roast for about, probably, if I put a roast in the crock pot, it'll probably last about two days, two, three days, okay? And we eat that, and then there's nothing wrong with having something like this as a meat source for the rest of the week. Come on, people. We got to get it together and make it easier. Like I said, work smarter, not harder. This is my kid's sandwich. Got the chicken patty, some tomatoes and shredded cheese on there and they already got their chips or whatnot and one of the key things is because it's processed drink water drink water <laughs> drink water and that'll help anyway because you know just because of meat but that's a good look it's way better than going paying fast food no shoot look we're trying to trying to make it price is too high <laughs> okay y'all so i wanted to show you this in case anybody interested so i showed y'all the box I got mine from Food Line, but you can get them from um, Walmart. Everybody got pretty much a Walmart near them. So they do um, Jamaican beef patties. Um, that's what you're going to look for. I think the box at Walmart, I think they have a great value brand too. But this is the one with cheese, okay? And this is how big it is. You can open it up and add some more cheese. I put some cheese under my bread or whatnot. But it's a flaky top with, with the beef and cheese in the inside, like grounded beef or whatnot. So... Y'all come in and let me know if y'all done had Jamaican beef patties or whatnot. I add some more cheese. I put a slice of tomato. And that's a meal. 438 here. And we came out and did a little stuff um, in Divine Treasure Guard. Um, trying to get my new whiskey barrel things inside the greenhouse and filmed or whatnot. So that was some more maneuvering around that. We had to do I'm gonna show y'all in a minute what we got because we came out here late came out here late now these mosquitoes is biting y'all even with having the mosquito cores and stuff out they tag me and tag me and tag me okay even with me spread it just whoo but let me go ahead and show y'all what we got done yep. we came out here late so this is what it's gonna look like I'm gonna have buckets along the sides and then have one row of these whiskey barrels going straight down the center. And I'm going to do that for both greenhouses, okay? But now, we just finna go in. I didn't want to go in and shower so I can make dinner. Okay, y'all. Let me just say this. The ground beef had already been browned. I had already browned that before I started filming. Actually, I thought I was filming me browning it. And I wasn't. The camera wasn't even on. So, yeah, I did like two of the family packs of ground beef, what they consider family packs because it don't look like that amount in there. But I, I did two packs. So, yeah, I just wanted to let y'all know, yes, ground beef was already brown before I started making the hamburger helper. I know how to cook, okay? <laughs> Maybe you only want what you can't have. Never seem to be satisfied Till it all goes bad Maybe I should just give someone else a chance Why should I sit alone and be sad While you fumble the best you to start over when we fell apart could have had it all but you pushed me right into his arms you wanted to break i wanted to stay look what you made me give my love away
today is November 7th. I haven't filmed much today. So, um, I wanted to come on here because I was in the middle of editing this video so I can get it out um, to y'all. So, not much going on. I already did a live screen today and had a good talking with y'all, okay? A good talking with y'all. So, as y'all can see, we're still in the rental. Like I said, we'll be in it probably for... I thought probably a, a week maybe, but it may be the two to three weeks, like they said. And, oh my goodness, I am loving it, loving it, loving it. Like I said, once me and Ronde started back sharing vehicles, I just <laughs> didn't, didn't drive, you know what I'm saying? And, um, you know, being a first-time buyer for my car, that, you know, I couldn't get what I want, you know, so I'm sitting here, I feel like, oh, oh, no, oh, no, no, so i just been kind of like strategizing, figuring out what I'm going to do uh, for as um, getting me something, because I want a van, um, because I had a van before, and it's easy, I can haul stuff, you know, I can let the seats down, haul stuff, and all that type of stuff, so, um, yeah, so, that that's what's going on even even you know with today november 7th still dealing with that but i wanted to also talk to you i mentioned something when i was editing this video i saw now y'all saw that i was telling y'all about the meat and stuff now don't get me wrong that is not an everyday thing but at the end of the day i have too much to do and i don't have time like that with everything i got going on and everything i'm trying to do I don't have the time like that to always come up with something. And I don't want nobody to feel like I'm saying, oh, go out and get all this processed stuff. Because y'all know, even with prepping, I talk about not stocking up on processed foods and all that type of stuff. Making that your main food source because it's not healthy. But, you know, having to get stuff like that and make a big meal out of it. Especially if you're growing your greens and stuff. And you can use that to you know kind of balance out you getting some chicken patties or something like that the main thing is you got to take care of yourself and you got to make things a little easier because with everything that's going on and finna go on with people that already we don't went through the selection and now people are already showing they 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 true self we're going to have to make time for ourselves be able to not overwhelm myself but still get the job done when it comes to making sure that we can eat and and, and have things that we need and have skills that's the main thing y'all i'm telling y'all this because i care and i see a lot of people not paying attention to stuff you know and that's another thing about me you know wanting to get me a bigger vehicle like i explained to y'all before how it was and it didn't hit me that you know, I'm thinking because a Ronde was is on the vehicle, you know, it didn't hit me until I had to go there and it was like, you know, I'm the primary, you know, and I'm like, you know, it really, really hit me. And then I thought about, you know, being the first time buyer and stuff like that. I'm saying, you know what, I done made some grounds. I have made some grounds and it didn't do nothing but motivate me even more, but motivate me in the right way because I want I like a van so I can haul stuff I can I can when I see stuff trees and stuff I can get it it's not just just for the luxury I mean it's five of us so we do need a bigger vehicle than what I have I have a Nissan the car that's in the shop is a Nissan um Central and like I said uh building my credit and stuff I had to if I wanted to be a buy something i had to be a first i was a first time buyer so they put me in something smaller but until now i have had a wake up call like look girl hustle do what you got to do and get the vehicle that you want you know um things happen with a ronde vehicle or whatnot so like i say we got down to one vehicle which was mine and um i'm just you know grinding to get what i need because you never understand you never know i want a bigger vehicle because i'm used to them you know what I'm saying? When I was back home, I, 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 my vehicles was bigger vehicles. And also, with a van, you may have to sleep in that. <laughs> I'm trying to strategize all the way around. You may have to sleep in that. You just never know. All right? So, it's a lot. It's a mythic to my madness, y'all. So, I wanted to just come and explain that little stuff because when I was looking at my vlogs, I'm like, okay, some people ain't going to understand what I'm saying and where I'm coming from. You know, especially doing the live screen that I did today. Um, I just don't have the time all the time to do things from scratch and all that type of stuff. Mm -mm, not going to overwork myself. If you have the time, then kudos. But I don't have time all the time to do that. 
okay so i'm gonna end this right here this is just uh you know i want to go and get this footage out because i've been holding on to it or whatnot um for the last couple of days so yeah i'm gonna go and get this out for y'all and i will see y'all in the next one don't forget to like comment and subscribe hit the notification bell so we notified each and every time that upload a video and i will see y'all in the next one if it's god's will y'all be safe okay until next time bye